One of the questions that we're asked a lot is uh, how do you track students in our system? And the answer is really simple because you don't track students in our system. Uh, a lot of teachers have come from other products where maybe there's a dashboard and it shows you that the students went through this far and they took this test, but, but they've seen these videos and watched these and haven't watched those and here's how long they were on the page. All that information is really only an attendance, right? It just says that the student was present on our web page for this amount of time with a video playing, or you know, they, they clicked on this many pages and had them load into their browser. But there's no real information on what the student learned. And the best way to evaluate student learning is to have them demonstrate to you in the software or on an exam, uh, you know, quiz or something, uh, if it's the soft skills stuff, that they really understand these concepts. So um, as far as student tracking goes, we don't do it. We don't believe that it works at all. We have no plans at all of ever adding that in. Um, and the main reason is that we, we don't think it works. It gives a real false sense of security to a teacher when you know you see that bar graph and, oh, it looks like all these bars are moving forward. Well, the bars may be moving forward because kids just click a link to let a video play and then they sit and talk with their friends and they're you know telling jokes or just whatever on their phones studying for another class who knows what's going on but that's exactly the point until you can see that they can take that knowledge off of the screen or out of the book or for any other type of off of your lecture and turn that into actual work in the application that a workplace would be willing to pay money for to employ that person that's the only way to know that they actually got those concepts down.